Hello friends, welcome to Chellas Katruner under the category of engineering material. Today we will see about SBR rubber that is sterine butane rubber. So we will see about its uh, uniqueness and its properties and advantages, disadvantages as well as application in this video. So what is SBR? It's a synthetic elastomer. So what is elastomer? Let's see here. So every single molecule is called monomer and multiple monomer connected through a chain is called polymer. So polymer which is having a uh, spring back nature to its original shape is called elastomer. That is elasticity nature is called elastomer. And it is uh, in the elastomer is natural rubber and synthetic rubber. There are two categories. So we are coming under synthetic rubber because it is made artificially in the chemical through chemical processing. So 75% of sterile and 25% of butane polymerized and we get a SBR rubber. So with the high sterile content, the rubbers are getting harder. And it's the second highest consumed rubber in the world. And it's very economical. And in the synthetic rubber category, it is the first highest consuming rubber in the world in all across the applications. So fillers are added for getting a good properties in the basic uh, SBR further fill, fillers are getting added to get a required properties like a, fillers are like carbon block, black, china clay, calcium carbonate and silica etc. So carbon black added for improving its strength properties. Now we can see the basic uh, raw material of SBR is Basically, it's naphtha. It's a byproduct of crude oil. Everybody knows. So from that, sterine is coming out, and ethylene also is coming out from naphtha. And further, ethylene is converted into butane. And this butane 25 percentage and sterine 75 percentage yielded to SBR. So polymerization process. There are two types of polymerization process are followed in SBR. One is through solution process that is SSBR is called and through emulsion process that SBR is called as a ESBR. So ESBR widely used in engineering applications. So like we have seen earlier slide. So fillers are added to getting a required properties and carbon black is a normally added in uh, SBR for improving its strength properties. And this will be further uh, can be processed through compression molding, transfer molding or injection molding. So let us understand some difference between the solution polymerization and emulsion polymerization. So it's in solution polymerization, it is mechanical agitations are used and monomer, medium, stabilizing agent and initiators are used and resulted to spear suspended in the solution medium. So coming to the emulsion polymerization, emulsions are used and monomer, water and surfactants are used and it can be easily separated and purified. And properties, so tensile strength of SSBR of 36 and ESBR is 20 and elongation percentage is 565 and ESBR is 635 and sore harness it varies from 30 to 95 based on filler additions and the additives addition. And temperature range to which it is withstand is minus 25 degrees Celsius to 100 degrees Celsius. And the compression set, it has to be tested as per ASTM D395. Let us understand advantages and disadvantages of SBR. So advantages are good abrasion resistance, good water resistance, good compression set properties and good aging properties and good metal adhesion properties. Disadvantages are a low chemical resistance, poor UV resistance, poor flame resistance and poor weather resistance. Now let us understand the applications of SBR. So SBR used in various products due to its uniqueness. So examples are o-ring, seals, shoe heels, tires and belt. So the Qualities of good compression set and high water resistance. That, that is the reasons it is being used in o-ring seal. 
and coming to other tires and shoe heels and belt the qualities of good abrasion resistance makes it to use in these products and this is one of the highest amount of material being used for tire manufacturing friends you have learned about sbr and its uniqueness and advantages and applications etc to understand how much knowledge you gathered out of this video we'll have a small quiz please answer in the comment section sbr has three types b two types sbr advantages is high abrasive resistance low chemical resistance esbr used to produce gloves or belt thanks friends thanks for watching our video please like and share our video and subscribe chellas cartoon channel thanks